now melts all away. For spring has sprung, and with it comes another Easter day. The church bells ring, and birdies sing, a bright cacophony. I celebrate with tea and cake, it's the British way for me. Uh -huh. uh, and beg for colored eggs, I fill my basket full. That's my new hat, you give it back, now aren't I beautiful? Thank you, Constable. We shall feel safe with you around. Good morning, Constable. By a lily for the orphans, all our pots in our plight. Just two pennies for a lily, and we'll sleep in soy tonight. Lily for the orphans, help the orphans buy a lily. Deppens for a lily, Governor. How's that? A lily girl for Easter. This? For Easter? Yes, sir. It's a symbol of new life and... But it's real. It won't last. Excuse me, sir? It'll be gone tomorrow. It's too fragile. See? This is what Easter's about. It's colorful. It's pretty. It's plastic. Then wouldn't you like this instead of your silly lily? Your grandmother helped the orphanage. She always bought a lily for Easter. My grandmother made Easter. Uh, just a moment, young lady. You forgot to pay for that egg. Ouch. We sing this tune as rainbows bloom on eggs red, green, and blue. Like colors in the windows when the sun comes shining through. The window here is mighty dear, a precious work of art. But patience, lass, we'll see this glass tomorrow when Easter starts. The hope of Easter's coming, coming to shine forth in the morn. It's coming now to bring us the gift of life reward. <coughs> hey, Dad, isn't that old man Nezer? Edmund, his name is Mr. Ebenezer Nezer. Uh, could you hand me an O? Sure. Is he really the richest man in town? Uh, I don't know about that, but his family has owned most of the property around here for generations. Uh, how about a couple of ours now? Even the land this old church sits on. Here you go. Why don't we ever see him in church? I don't really know. I heard he used to come when he was little. His grandmother would bring him. Uh, I need an O now and a W if you can find it. <coughs> so, why doesn't he come anymore? How about an upside down M? Maybe he just doesn't like Easter. Oh, sure he does. Why, he makes all the Easter eggs in his factory. Yeah, but why doesn't he celebrate Easter with the rest of us? Doesn't he like church? Tell you what, we'll go see him later and invite him ourselves to see the unveiling of the new stained glass window tomorrow. In the meantime, you be respectful. Hey, isn't that old man Nezer? church instead of out buying more by eggs. Right. Well, see ya. What was that supposed to be? I don't know. I panicked. Oh, let me handle this. And uh, would you like the morning report, sir? Oh, let me guess. 
Egg production is up. I said I wanted to get. I'd say we have eggs aplenty. Well, that depends on how you look at things. Is the egg tank half full or half empty? The workers are happy, uh, though a little bit tired. A satisfying fatigue of productivity. And there'll be a beautiful service at St. Bart's tomorrow. You'd think so, wouldn't you? All in all, this should be a glorious Easter. Uh, so, um, Mr. Nezzer? Don't you have chickens to tend? M may I ask you a question? No. Um, Mr. Nezzer, what I wanted to ask you was, uh, well, everything is going so well, so uh, couldn't we, uh, uh, close up shop just for Easter? What? Close up shop? Do you know what that would mean? Uh, you know when my grandmother started this factory? Oh, no, here comes the speech again. 112 years ago. <laughs> yeah, I know, sir. 113. She was making Easter before you were born. One hundred thirteen years ago with one chicken and a coop My grandma started dying eggs for the local Girl Scout troop She started making money and as her business grew She got more hens and colors and she knew just what She built herself a factory to do what she loved best. She kept on dying Easter eggs, but then you know the rest. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, she... I suppose it was bound to happen. Her age she could not hide. More than a hundred years of living, and then one day she died. But before she drifted off that day, she whispered in my ear, Those words I never shall forget, I still hear them loud and clear. She said, Ebby? She always used to call me Ebby. Ebby, I've taught you the family business, and with my dying breath, I say you tell every single person Easter means no death. Now at first, this all confused me. Till then, I realized... That as long as I make Easter eggs, it's like she's still alive. She built herself a factory to do what she loved best. And I'll keep making Easter eggs, my one and only quest. Tomorrow, the world will see how I'm gonna make Easter even bigger and better. And Grandma will live forever, just like she wanted. So you see, we can't just stop the factory. That would let Grandma down. But, Abby, uh, Mr. Nezzer, sir, I, uh... Hello there. Mind if we come in? That'll be all. Now get back to work. But I don't work here. Well, I'm not hiring either. Oh, no. That's not why we're here. We came to... Oh, yo, then! church fella, aren't you? Well, yes, I guess I am. So why are you here? Well, sir, I know your grandmother used to bring you to church. She loved Easter so much. Yes. Then you'll come? No. But you said... I said, yes, my grandmother loved Easter. What's not the love with the eggs and the candy? Oh, but Mr. Nezzer, we miss you at the Easter service. If you ask me, you've got enough people locked up already, sitting in those pews when they should be out buying more eggs. Uh, I'm sorry? Look, I know my grandma liked that old church, but I have no idea why. I need to make Easter bigger to keep her alive, and that church is just in the way. What? And that's why I'm working on this. Ooh. Is that one supposed to be me? Because I'm not that fat. Sorry. 
Tomorrow is my grandma's birthday, and she has given me a job to do. So I've been saving all my money to make her Easter dream come true. Easterland, where Easter is forever! <laughs> Don't you just love it? Easterland? What's that supposed to be? Oh, you're really going to love this. I'll make Easter last all year long. We'll have Easter egg hunts every day to please the massive throng. Throng? It means lots of people. Everyone will buy my eggs and I'll give them more to munch. They'll buy my yummy chocolate bunnies for breakfast, dinner, lunch. Grandma will be proud of me for keeping her alive and dear. Church was her most favorite place, so Easterland will be right here. She built herself a factory to do what she loved best. And so I'm building Easterland, my one and only quest. But that's not what she meant. You can't do that. Of course, I have to build a chocolate bunny factory, too. You can't tear down the church. Don't be silly. That land has been in my family for generations. If you just came to the service, you'd realize that... you got to talk to him. <clears throat> Uncle Ebenezer, Easter is a time when... When I am interrupted... My people bugging me to come to church and save the orphans and shut my factory. But early tomorrow morning, a crew will start at eight on knocking down that little church and building something great. And folks will come from miles around In trains, on bikes, on legs And Grandma will live forever Just like my little plastic kids and he hasn't done anything, yet. What are we gonna do? Well, we just need to have hope. Awfully late, Lassie. Yes, sir. But is it true what they're saying about the church? Aye, lass. It's true. But what's going to happen? What about the orphanage? What will become of us? <sighs> Let me see your home, lass. Amen. <coughs> Amen. Now, you get to sleep. It's late and we've all got a big day tomorrow. Dad? Yes? I'm still really worried about old man, I mean, Mr. Nezer tearing down the church. What do we do? Now, Edmund, as crazy as it sounds, you have to have hope. Hope? Hope for what? Hope that no matter what happens, God is taking care of us. I guess so, but... Faith is being sure of what we hope for and certain of what we do not see. Good night, Edmund. I love you. I love you too, Dad.
the concession stand will go right here. And the gift shop. Oh, it's going to be great, Grandma. You're really going to like it. I'll put your picture right over the door. Lesson lived is wisdom gived. Uh, gived? What? I'm dead. Cut me some slack. Ebenezer, you are in for a wild ride. Huh? At the stroke of midnight, you will receive a second visit. Hold on tight. something? It didn't work out so well. Millward, we've got to save that church. Come on now, hoist me up. Okay. You're stepping on my... Oh, Ouch. Just a little higher. Oh, you're slipping. Oh. If you could just... Whoa. Sorry. Try again? I'm just going to stay awake. I'm not tired at all. I'm just going to stay wide. Hey, just a little bit. I can't quite. No, no, just, just an inch or two. I'm trying as hard as I can. Got it. Millward? <gasps> a casual. Millward? Millward? Shh.
What? Hey! What? It's a bug! A big bug! Do I look like a bug to you? You're the visitor! Ding, ding, ding! Give the man a prize. Perhaps you aren't as dense as they say. So, what are you doing here? Maybe you are. Did you hear anything your grandmother said? Uh, something about me missing the point or something. Yes, Ebenezer, you've missed the point. The point of Easter, the point of that church over there. The... Oh, I know the point of that church. They try to keep people cooped up all Easter so they can't buy my eggs. And that's why we'll all be better off without it. It's going to be a long night. Come on, let's get going. We've got some ground to cover. Uh-huh. Easy. Ah, ah, what are we doing up here? Take me back! Not so fast, big fella. I've got lots to show you. Could you put it in a picture book? Or oh, oh, maybe some slides? Nice try. Look, you're going to see many things tonight, but mostly you're going to see that you are a first-class stinker. Oh, you're not a miser or a scrooge or anything like that. You just don't see what's right in front of you. <gasps> oh, here we are. Ebenezer? Ebenezer! Would you quit clowning around? We don't have all night! Ooh. Oh. Ah. Oh. Is this place still here? Uh, this is where I built Meesterland, you know. So I heard. After you. What's your name, anyway? It's Hope. Hey, you gotta help me. I've been kidnapped by a bug. What's the matter with that guy? You're not really here. Huh? Hey, it's Grandma! Grandma, you're okay! What are you doing here? She can't hear you. Hi, Grandma! You feeling okay? You're not really here, Ebenezer. This is Easter past. Easter past? Oh. Well, that's Grandma, all right. But I don't remember that funny looking kid. That's you. Now hush up and listen. <gasps> Ooh, that's my first Easter basket. I remember that. Hey, it's empty. Yes, just like the tomb in the story. Now listen, Ebenezer, this is important. But there's nothing here. Oh, oh, look, look. Not even a jelly bean. Christmas. Christmas? Yes, that's where the story begins. You can't have one without the other. You see, hey, that baby buddy, boy born so wanna buy an Easter egg? Boy, listen to your grandma. She's only trying to help you, you know. And you won't listen to anybody. Yeah, I noticed. Come on, nothing more to see here. Hmm? I still don't understand that Christmas thing. Sure was a pretty picture, though. Seems a pity you're gonna knock it down. Yeah. Can I go home now? Oh! Great! Well, uh, thanks for a very lovely evening. I sure did learn a lot, but I got a business to run, so be sure to say hi to your little bug friends for me, okay? What? Huh? Well, now you mess things up. I got two of me. Hang on. This is still Easter past. A year ago. Don't you remember this day? Oh, Grandma. The chickens have been slowing down since you, uh... Since you, uh... <laughs> but I've got a plan. Seymour, uh, thanks for coming. Ooh, what's that? Uh, it's my latest invention. <laughs> the Easter Buffonia. Ooh, ooh, how's it work? Oh, you just throw this lever and watch the fun. <laughs> mm -hmm. I like that crazy beat. <laughs> so, uh, you called for an inventor? Why, yes, I did, Seymour. You see, I got a little problem. Problem? Problem. Problem. Yes, I got a little problem with my chickens. Chickens? Birds. Boys. Birds. Well, I don't know why you call me then. I'm an inventor. And I don't know much about boys. Boys? Boys. Yep, and I don't know nothing much about boys. Well, that's exactly why I called you, friend. I need a way to make eggs around the clock. Tick, 
Duck, these real chickens always need a rest, you see. They don't rest. But where do I come in? Well, I hear you're a whiz when it comes to inventing. Inventing? Inventing. Mechanization. Industrialization. Inventing things sure is fun. Well, what I need, my friend, is a row of chickens. Chickens? Chickens. Mechanical chickens, as far as the eye can see. Boys. You catch on quick. But what about the eggs? Eggs? Eggs! Eggs! What about the eggs? Can a tin chicken lay real eggs? Plastic. Plastic? Plastic, my friend, in whatever color you can think it. Plastic. 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 Yes, with mechanical chickens and plastic gags, I can make Easter bigger than before. Easter? Easter. Yes, Easter. Wait a minute. You can't make Easter bigger with plastic eggs. What I said, my friend, is... No, 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 no. You got it all wrong. What do you mean? Easter's not about plastic eggs and bunnies and baskets. But isn't Easter supposed to last forever? Oh, of course. And doesn't plastic last forever? Uh, yeah, but... I don't see the difference. Well, it's kind of... Inventing things sure is fun. Uh, how's that? I said inventing things sure is fun. Plastic? Plastic. Plastic. Chickens. Boids. Chickens. Laying eggs all night long. Chickens. Chickens. Boids. Chickens. Chickens. Boids. Mechanical chickens. What? Did you even pay him? I gave him an annual pass to Easterland. A 10% off at of the gift shop. Oh, well, that's generous. You think? Out, you. Oh, my. It's night again. You keep messing with the lights. So, uh, what happened here? This isn't your past, Ebenezer. This is the present. A present? For me? Oh, you shouldn't have. No, not a present. The present. Easter present. The here and now. Oh, lovely. Let's go for a ride. Okay, okay. I got another idea. Oh, what's this place? Shh, listen. Well, if Neza really knew how his grandmother felt, he wouldn't touch that old church. I wouldn't? No, she sure loved that old place. Did you know she paid for all those beautiful windows herself? Aye, and the new window we were going to unveil tomorrow. She commissioned it just before she passed away. She sure would have loved everyone to see it. Now Neza's going to knock the whole thing down. I should have talked with him more. Dear, this isn't your fault. No. It's that old sour Nezer's fault. Why, I'd like to take that old coal scuttle and teach him a thing or two. I'd weave his Easter basket into a pretty kettle of fish. I'd, I'd, uh, I, uh, I guess he just needs to get out of that factory and find out what Easter is really all about. <laughs> What a ninny. The factory is what Easter's all about. The eggs, the baskets. You don't get it, do you? They're talking about the hope of Easter. The hope of Easter changes everything. If you take it away, you won't like what you'll get. I'll get a lot more time for folks to buy eggs. That's what I'll get. And I'll get to build Easterland and keep my grandma alive forever. <sighs> Mom? Dad? Edmund. You're supposed to be asleep. I know, but I couldn't sleep and, well, I've been thinking. Yes? Mr. Nezer isn't a bad man. What a sweet little boy. No, he just doesn't have something that we all have. The thing that lets us celebrate Easter all year long. <coughs> Come on, Edmund. What's going on? How sick is he? Very sick, I'm afraid. Well, is he gonna... If nothing changes, this will be his last Easter. <gasps> when are the doctors gonna tell his parents? They already know. What? They know? But, but they're so calm! How can they be so calm? I, I don't... I don't understand! Ebenezer, are you ready to listen? There's a story that started on Christmas When a baby was born in the night And those who came far Who followed this star 
there'd be no hope. But it isn't. God has made a way for all who mourn and breathe. Death will never be the end if you just believe. To give us hope, he rose. The hope of Easter is life everlasting if you believe in who he is and what he did for you. If you believe. Of course, we all have to live with our decisions. Huh? The world would be a better place if that church was never built. What? Oh, oh that. I... I'm afraid it's time to see what this town would be like without the hope of Easter. Welcome to Easter Future. Come on, we've got to get out of here! Please, sir, would you buy a pencil? You can see me? All right, now go home, you little street urchin. I've got no home, sir, but bless you. What? I, I don't understand. Isn't the orphanage taking care of her? It was, but the orphanage was founded by folks filled with the hope of Easter. No Easter, no hope, no orphanage. Hey! My pencils! <laughs> hey! Somebody stop him! Oh, he'll get him. Stop! Thief! Oh, yeah? Well, what are you gonna do about it? Uh, nothing. Nothing at all. <laughs> I don't get it. What do you think made him brave in the first place? Without the hope of Easter, why would anyone risk their life for someone else? No more. Hope, show me no more. We're not finished, I'm afraid. 
Reverend Gilbert. Oh no. Don't tell me. No. What have I done? It can't end this way. We have to change it. Hope. Hope? Hope! Tell me it can change! Tell me it doesn't have to be this way! Hope! We need you! How about stop? Stop! Stop! We need hope! Today? Yeah, 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 today. What day is it? Why, it's Easter Sunday. <gasps> Easter Sunday! Easter Sunday! It never sounded sweeter. It's not too late after all. Bye, Lily, Governor. <gasps> Thank you, Governor. <gasps> the church. <gasps> oh, happy Easter, Grandma. I can't go on. I can't go on. No, we can't give up, Millward. There must be some way to get in there. Good morning, boys. A happy Easter. Nice balloons. Huh? Here's our break, Millward. Okay, I'll get the plans. You keep watch. Oh dear. Thank you for coming so early, everyone, to what will be the last Easter Sunday we celebrate in this church. <laughs> Moyer is talking to the workmen right now to see if they'll give us just a few minutes. <sighs> we are very sorry, Reverend, but we have our doubts. This church, she must come down. Oh, gentlemen, please. It is a crying shame, but you cannot stand in the way of progress! Wait! Don't touch this church! Mr. Nezer! What did you say? I said, don't touch this church! I know I told you to tear it down, that we'd all be better off without it. But I was wrong! I know that now! I thought Easter was about eggs and candy. But it's more than that! It's about hope! The hope that this life isn't all there is! That dying isn't the end! It's a new beginning! If you believe! That's what my grandma was trying to tell me! That's what this church has been telling people since... since before I was born! I've seen what life would be like without the hope of Easter. Believe me, you don't want to go there. This church is staying right here so that everybody can hear about the hope of Easter. Just like my grandma would want it. Somebody! Anybody! The factory! The chickens! It's all gonna blow! What? We tried to turn off the chickens, but they're too hot. I got out okay, but Calvis is inside. He's trapped! Someone! Call the police! Call the fire department!
I came to get you. You did? Yes, Tavis, I did. Oh, come on. There isn't much time. Once that needle hits the red, we're done for. I guess they're all free this year. Mr. Nazar? So, what are you gonna do? What am I gonna do? I'm gonna do what matters most. Reverend, with whatever money I got left, I'm gonna help you fix up that orphanage. And I'm gonna make sure that boy gets his medicine. Your grandmother would be proud. I think she is. Well, how are you gonna afford that? The factory's gone! It's all gone! <laughs> Well, why are we all standing around here? It's Easter Sunday! And God blessed us, everyone! We sing this tune as cow is blue and snow melts all away. For spring has sprung and with it comes another Easter day. The birdies sing and church bells ring, announcing a new birth. We celebrate this joyous day for heaven here on earth. See you later. <laughs> 